Well, that was weird. Um, Nano 9, ship status report. The AE 35 unit has been damaged on board our poor human, human. Cryo status pods are intact. Captain Lissafet intact. The most important Dr. Nano back creator of Nano 9 intact. Mixologist Cyber Banda intact. Lieutenant Commander Brandan Man intact. Must replace AE 35 unit before orbital failure and structural collapse. Better work fast. Oh boy. Uh, what does that mean? Well, that is a pronoun used to specify a person, place, or thing, but that's not important right now. Don't patronize me, Ernie. That means you gotta repair me or else we're gonna fucking crash and the state of the art nuclear fusion reactor on board will re certainly split the planet in half. Bad. Uh, sh shit. Um, I guess you should have brought a uh, trained astronaut with you. I've synced up your pip boy, Mil you meant the repair schematics can be reached there. Good luck. Oh, look at that. Yeah. It's got the whole repair schematic right here. Okay, Tracy, we need to fix exhaust manifold caliper X98F. What? Yeah, so do you know what that... It should what? be X98F. It should be a small machine... This? Is it this? I think that's it. Hey, that made that black smoke go away. That's probably good. That's definitely good. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Number two, it says uh, reset power coupling breaker A. Power coupling oh. breaker A. Well, this one says, that says C. B. Um, All right, now you got to reset that power coupling too. Okay. Yeah, there you go. That looks right. Perfect. The next go. one it says uh, reset power coupling breaker B. All right. I I think I got this. There we go. This is pretty easy. I guess I could be an astronaut after all. All right, and now it says reset power coupling breaker C. Ooh, ah, uh, uh, that, that, mm, tickles. Oh, how about that? <laughs> How's that feel, Nano Redir 9? <laughs> Redirect auxiliary power to bridge door via auxiliary power room. All right, and it says this is the auxiliary power room. Cryo bed one now accessible. Reanimation sequence for cryo bed one now active. I think we can get on the bridge now. What? Upstairs? Yeah. Now hold on, I think it's pressurizing in there though. Do you hear that? Yeah. It's, yeah, it's just adding air now. It's pressurized in there. Okay. Now I can go in. Oh wow, yeah, there's this must be cryo bed one. Is there somebody in there? Oh wow. Whoa. Uh Hello. 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 Nano nine report. The AE thirty five unit has been damaged on board our port. Human, human, cryo status pods are intact. Captain Lissa Fett intact. The most important Dr. Nano Fett, creator of Nano 9, intact. Mixologist. Yeah, yeah. And that's that. Hmm. Um, hi, um, I'm Tracy, and this is uh, Azriel. 
I really don't care. Can you give him a drink? Uh, the ship is badly damaged, and someone needs to do a spacewalk to do to make the last repair. Oh, I I don't do spacewalks. Um, again, maybe you should have brought a trained and experienced astronaut with you, Azrael. Stop patronizing me. I mean, if we don't get this fixed, we're gonna crash into Earth. Can you help us? I can get you a drink. What would you like? Kill Sunrise is my specialty. Well, I guess I'll have to do it myself. Um, are you qualified to do that? Well, I've read about it. Well, that's the way outside. Um, definitely above my pay grade. All right. I guess this is the the, the door to get out. Um, All right. So you're gonna have to close the airlock for me you, on that side. You be uh, super careful out there. Um, yeah. Are you ready? I'll be fine. I think oh. so. Yeah. Always wanted to do this. I think I'm so excited. I think you're forgetting something. Uh, what? Your your helmet. Oh. I don't want to go outside without that? Yeah, I probably need the helmet on. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. There you go. Okay. Uh, All right. Now I'm ready. All right. Be careful. Now opening the exterior door. Um. Think we'll be able to see him out there? Yeah, we should see him outside. Making a pass by the binary window. So, so what's your job? Oh yeah, I saw him. I have a mix of you know, mix drinks. Tether connection to forward coupling. Uh, okay. Appears to be slightly damaged. Pulling out clogged hair from the 8E35 unit now. So is everybody uh, everybody else on board as cool as you? Nah, I'm way cooler than everyone else. I mean, come on. Uh. Death claw? Come on. <laughs> yep, it looks like the AE35 unit is showing in repair. Uh, headed back. No, that was quick. He's pretty handy. All right, I re-entered the ship and now pressurizing the airlock. Airlock is now pressurized. All right, here I'll uh, I'll let you in. Ready? Oh. Uh, could you open the door? Um, the switch doesn't seem to be working. Um. That switch engages the main thrusters, and if the main power was on, you would have charred him to a crispy crisp. <laughs> oh, <laughs> wrong switch. I'm sorry. There you go. <laughs> well, thank goodness it wasn't powered up. <laughs> was that fun? Now, we finalize the repairs. Oh, cool. You're going to help us finish the repairs? Oh no, I don't do repair work. That is above my pay grade. The USSA space program doesn't pay nictologists very well, so, you know, good luck with that. Oh, uh, I hate to tell you this, um, but the space program's not really there anymore. Um, Nuka Cola caps are the new currency. Wait, what? All right, Jay-Z, the next step is turning off the reset exhaust manifold and turn the breaker for main power. Uh, okay. All right, let me look at the schematic again. Looks like it's over here. Yep, it's through that door. Oh, I have to do it? Well, yeah, I mean, isn't this fun? Aren't you having fun? I don't know, I'm a little scared. This way? Yep. Okay. All right, so 
What what do I need to do? You have to turn off R, turn on MP, and that'll turn off the reset the exhaust manifold, and turn the breaker for main power. Okay, here we go. Main power. Looks like that did it. Oh, yay! Now that the main power is on, the mixology station is Can I get you something to drink? Um, you got whiskey? Only the best base whiskey. <laughs> yeah, I just gotta reset the main power in here. I think we could open these cryo beds in here now. You know these cryo beds over here? You mean the popsicle people? <laughs> hey, you you've been here all this time. Do they need medical attention? Damn, I'm a mixologist, not a doctor. Come on, really? Seriously? preserved uh, hello I'm Tracy 23 Captain? from Wastelander 1 Israel 660 from Wastelander 1 hi Captain? What do we do, Captain? Report in. Captain, this is... <clears throat> the captain's comm wasn't working. <laughs> okay, everyone. We've trained for this. Everyone to the bridge in your assigned locations. For an emergency status report. Uh, I guess we go on the bridge uh, too. Uh, yeah, I guess. Um. Um, I'll just I'll sit by you. Doctor. Captain? Doctor? Bartek? Bartek? Captain? Doctor? Captain? Doctor? Doctor? Bartek! <clears throat> Nano 9. Ship status report. Nano 9, status update. Um, kind of took Nano 9 offline. She was getting eight lippy, you know? You what? Yeah, I took her offline. It seems like she had an attitude. Oh my god, are you fucking kidding? The whole project was to see if we could produce an AI with emotions. You shut her down? She needs two days to reboot. And won't retain any memory. Can I get you a tequila sunrise? Okay, let's focus. Manual status update. Manual status update. Um, <clears throat> um, um well, uh, well, let's see here. The year's 2104, and the world has gone to hell in a handbasket. Nuclear fallout everywhere. 
Commander Daggerty found a signal from your space station that was in a decaying orbit and set to crash in West Virginia, or what's left of it anyway. We repaired the damage and have corrected the orbit. Damn, that's a lot to take in. Panda, can I get a vodka? Make it double. Yeah, sure. Uh, Dano. Gigi. Ezreal. Um, I wouldn't mind some, um, if you got some, like, uh, like, a, like some Brahmin milk, maybe? I'll, I'll take yeah. some, uh, cranberry moonshine. I yeah. need a, a big, good choice, good choice. big glass. Oh, yeah. Crazy. I'll take a whiskey. That whiskey we were, we were talking about earlier. Yeah, I'll take a whiskey. That'd be great. Oh, yeah, yeah. Space whiskey. I don't know how to drink. And I think I'm going to take a nap. I'm going to wake me up if anything interesting happens. What the fuck? <laughs> <sighs> Dr. Nano, status of communications. Right on that cut. Communications, functional, Captain. Open up a channel on all frequencies, please. Channel is open. Come in, Houston. This is Captain Lissafet of the USSA Nano 9. Come in, Houston. Um, I don't think Houston is there anymore. Come in, D.C. D.C. This is the USSA Nano 9. Come in. No response, Captain. Hmm. Turn all sensors to search for ground signals. Captain, it seems that we are getting very weak signals from West Virginia and Pittsburgh, but not that we can communicate on. Do another sweep. Scan and widen the range of bandwidth. Captain, we're receiving a weak signal. It appears to be a distress beacon coming from the lunar surface. It seems to be coming from our lunar base. Pause. Delta Sierra Ostrich Morgan. What's that? That. That? Oh, that is a pronoun used to specify a person, place, or thing. But that's not important right now. Are you talking about the dark side of the moon? Shh. It's a secret base. And there are civilians present. The signal is on repeat. It seems to be an automated signal. There is no response back. The signal is on repeat. It seems to be an automated signal. There is no response back. The signal is on repeat. It seems to be an automated signal. There is no response back. Repeat, don't repeat. Plot of course, too. <clears throat> Plot of course. Plotting a course to the, for the secret lunar base on the dark side of the moon. Course is set in lock position. Engage. Oh, I wanted to say that. Well, the next time we're flying in space together, after you've graduated from Vault Tech U with honors in Valedictorian, after spending eight years training in Space Fleet Academy, and after posting as an ensign grunt for five years, and after serving as the first officer of a total narcissistic dick for another ten years, and when you finally get promoted to captain, then you'll get the same gauge, okay? There is no space program anymore. Then I guess you won't be able to say it then, will you? Engage. 
We are already engaged. Oh, who's engaged? Sounds like a celebration. Champagne. Let me get one a drink. Captain, we have mapped the moon's orbit. We are aligned with the cave entrance where the signal is coming from. Very good, Doctor. Okay, everyone, let's get to the landing shuttles. Oh my god, we're gonna go on the moon! This is awesome! I'm so excitedly scared. <laughs> Where do we go? I guess we're going down here. Oh. Must be a malfunction. Shutting the door behind you. I'm scared. Oh my gosh, here we go! Are we here? We have Adriel, landed. I can't see we have you. landed. Azriel, where are you? We have landed. I repeat, we have landed. Some of us like to sleep without any clothes on. I do. You gotta watch out, it's really close. It's really cold on the moon. Okay. Oh no wow. More. I'm getting a weird signal from that object up there. Object? Where? Are you talking about that monolith looking thing? Yeah, this object that's right over here. Sugar bombs, less than two rats per serving. Sugar bombs, they're out of this world. 
Not recommended by the doctors. Last off with chicken bones. And cut. Good job, everybody. Good job. <laughs> Good thing they did this in one take. It would have at least taken us two days to get back to Earth and redo the launch. Right? That's absolutely crazy. Everybody did a fantastic job, though. <laughs> All right, you ready to unpack everything that we brought with us for the next one? Wait. Do you hear that signal? Oh wow, there is a life sign coming from over here. What? Yeah, there's some there's something else out here. Oh my goodness. It looks like it's another cryo bed. What? Open it. Mmm, what took you so long? I've been waiting you for days. Uh, I did get some beauty sleep in there though. It's so cold though. <laughs> Mr. Mm. Chow? Yeah, yeah, um, how do I look? Um, okay, let's get the, the stupid commercial done, okay? We, we, we have to do multiple type and, uh, take a sugar bomb commercial? You know, uh, Brahmin outfit, cryolators, you know, sauce my face, yeah, yeah, yeah. I like to start my day with a big bowl of sugar bomb, okay? <laughs> okay. Right? Well, right? Yeah, let's uh let's let's go over and get set up, everyone. Alright, extracting the modules now. Excellent, excellent. Alright, let's go with commercial one. Oh. Mm. Okay, I guess I sit down now. <clears throat> okay. All right, and you remember your lines, Mr. Chow? Uh, this cereal is so good, it tastes like heaven. Blast off your morning with sugar bombs. All right, are we ready? Maybe. All right, sugar bombs commercial two. You take one. Do we, do we have uh, a bell? Did the bell survive the trip? And action! Hi everybody! Let's go ahead and start the day with Big Bowl Sugar Bomb. Blast off with a sugar bomb. Let's turn on that radio over there to start my day, okay? No radio today? Maybe. Okay. Never mind. Mr. Chow, th those were not your lines. Cut. Cut. Don't shoot me again. I fuck you up, you stupid Brahmin shit. All right, do you want to go ahead with uh, the the Modern Family take first, baby? Let's try the Modern Family one first. Maybe we can come back around for the other. Yeah, can yeah, we get the uh, dogs do barking one, um... in the background um, soundtrack during this? Uh... That'd be great. Okay. Rolling. Okay. Um, and uh, mm. do we have Billy? We can still have the Brahmin. Mm. Can we have maybe the Brahmin uh, back back up a little bit in the frame? And then, uh, Mr. Chow, will you be Billy? <laughs> Mr. Chow. <laughs> yep. Perfect. Let me just get you on the chair. 
Yeah, that's great. Okay, and then I'm going to be the mom here. Let me just get her into camera mode. Alright, that's perfect. And uh, the Brahmin, the two Brahmin that are uh, behind the actors, if you could uh, stage right a little bit so we can see you better. There you go, that's great, yes. There we go, perfect. And then Azriel, if you could stand on m my other side. Um, we ne I need to be here for the bell. Oh, okay, that's great then. Okay, perfect. Okay, and yeah, maybe have one of the Brahmins be right on the other side of the cabinet and one in between Billy and the announcer. Perfect, yes. Okay, great. Are we ready? All right, this is uh, Sugar Bombs Commercial 3. Take one. And action. Modern mothers know they're busy all throughout the day, and morning is no exception. How can the mother of a go find time? How? Cut. 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 Okay. And then the Brahmin can move around. That would be fine. You know, since you guys are on the moon, you're just kind of prancing around in the background. Like, you're real Brahmin. Just, you know, like, really feel the Brahmin, you know? Maybe, you know, some squatting, like you're looking for grass, even though you're on the moon. Yeah. Yes, perfect. Okay. Commercial three, take two. And action. Modern mothers know they're busy all throughout the day. And morning is no exception. How can the mother on the go find time to ensure her family gets the nutrition they need? You can say that again. Some days there's just no time to cook. And my children are such fussy eaters. Worry no more, Mom. Just turn to Sugar Bombs, America's leading breakfast cereal. Just add cold milk, and your family has a delicious, nutritious breakfast. With 47 grams of sugar per serving, you can feel confident your loved ones will have the energy need to face the day. Thanks, sugar bombs! And they're not just good for you. Kids love the delicious taste. Isn't that right, Billy? <laughs> That's right, sir. Hi, everybody. I'm Billy, average American boy. Gosh, I sure do love sugar bomb cereal. It puts a real pep in my step. What's more right now, if you collect 10 box tops from sugar bomb cereal, you can send them in a real doctor's orbital decoder wristband and a booklet of fun activities. It's swell. <laughs> Thanks, Billy. So remember... Smart moms choose sugar bombs for a happy and healthy family. Sugar bombs. And cut. Oh my god, that was absolutely amazing. Great take, everybody. Great take. <laughs> Good job, Billy. Much obliged, woman. Average American boy. I think we need to get Chow back in here so we can go ahead with the the international um, start of the international commercials. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I sit on again. Maybe I need to do stretching. Azriel, are you okay over there? Yeah. Yeah, I'm it looks like he uh, had action over there. <laughs> yeah, I'd, no, I'd... just a just a little bit of depressurization. I think I'll be fine. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm ready for the, the effect for this one too for extra Brahmin milk. All right, everybody set. Brahmin commercial four, international. Take one. 
and action. Oh,喂,喂,喂,喂,喂,喂,喂,喂,喂,喂,喂,喂,喂,喂,喂,喂,喂,喂,喂,喂,喂,喂,喂,喂,喂,喂,喂,喂,喂,喂,喂,喂,
and action. Okay,Sugarbomb,炸彈 Sauce me that much. And cut. I think that was a great take, guys. Great take. <laughs> I don't care. Anyway, I'm so hungry. Uh, I guess I have to take some of these uh, sugar bombs just to eat a little bit. I've been waiting for so long. <laughs> yeah, yeah, make it extra heavy. <laughs> Uh, don't look at me, all you. Don't look at me. Turn around. I don't want you seeing me eating. <laughs> no, really. Fuck you. <laughs> Roll away. I'm going to eat. Are you ready for your commercial, Nino? <laughs> oh, 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 um. Chow down, chow down. Oh, oh no. How <gasps> many, how many sugar bombs did you let him eat? Oh no. Oh, oh no. Oh no. Right <laughs> I'm, I'm not the one who did it. Oh uh, no. Dr. Nano, can you, uh, can you see if we got oh, life signs let's here? See. You're a doctor, Nano. Wow. Dead ass though. <laughs> okay. Yeah, uh, he's dead. <sighs> Nothing we could do about that. What a shame. Okay, well, what can we try to keep him out of the now. shot um, for the next commercial? That would be great. Okay, let's see if we can. If that helps. <laughs> 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 that was... Oh, um, oh my. It's a good thing um, there's low gravity out here because he just got launched, so it's good. Alright. Godspeed. Alright, Dr. Nano, are you ready? Uh, yes, I am. Alright. Alright, Sugar Bombs Commercial 5, take 1. And Hello. action. Hello, I'm Dr. Nano. And I've created sugar bombs. My own special recipe. It has some very special things into it. You'll love it. Eat it now. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Where is and Nano 9 when cut. I'm here? Alright, uh, we can probably save that in editing. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> Was there a script? <laughs> oh hell. Wait, Wait, there's a script for this? <laughs> I, I didn't see that part. <laughs> no one told me. Well, I would like to take this moment to give everybody a shout out. Thank you very much, uh, Michael Jackson, The Nano Effect, Alyssa Fett, Cyber Panda. Thank you all so much. And of course, Mr. Chow, wherever you are. Brandon. And special. Brandon. Brandon. Brandon, the man. A very special thank you to Tracy23. Hey, that's me. 
And then I would also like to give a very special, special uh, thank you to uh, Freight Train, Breaker Breaker 19 to Freight Train. Uh, this was very much uh, dedicated to you, Uncle. Love you. Hey, what's up, everybody? I'm still alive, bitches. <laughs> Ah, uh, we didn't get rid of him that easily, dang. Yeah, that was probably a stunt double again. More soft. Well, it looks like, like a stunt double. What does he have? Darn clone. I just tapped into your radio frequency. It looks like my other counterpart just got it from space. <laughs> you didn't steal our spaceship, did you? Uh, no. Uh... Oh, crazy! since we're here, you know, I, I was talking with Michael Jackson and he showed me how to do something. Check this out. Okay. I could do the moonwalk. Oh, wow. But you're not the moon. I can do the moonwalk. Oh. This it's a done. dance competition. I hear Astronaut Michael likes space to take... Party? I hear Michael likes to take long walks up here under the earth light. Yeah, he was what? telling me about that, too. That's how we made the dance. War? <gasps> Burr. Astronaut space party! You know, speaking of dancing, maybe I can make a video game with a board that says Dance Dance Voltolution. <laughs> anyway, I'm signing off now. So long, Brahmin Packers! Bye, Mr. Chow. Bye, Mr. Chow. I did think it was kind of funny we went to space and didn't see any alien ships. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for everybody who's one tuned in. Alien. Everybody who's here, Azriel, all of your builds were amazing. This was absolutely fabulous. Uh, your brainchild. Um, thank you, everybody. Bye.